Final time in the state of Iowa, three Siouxland teams find themselves just one win away from a chance at a championship. Sports Force's Amber Salas has been in Des Moines all week. She has more. More semifinal action is underway here at the Iowa Boys State Basketball Tournament. All three teams have played in a championship game before. Now they're giving it their all on the hardwood, determined to make their way back to the big game. The Central Lion Lions have been working hard all season to get back to the championship game. All that's needed is a semifinal win over Pella Christian. Early on, Zach Lutmer goes down low to Andrew Austin and rise up big fella. He slams it home to get the energy going. Lutmer with the assist again here, this time to Josh Elbert on the corner who takes his shot at the tray and gets it. Lions take a one point lead to the second now. The Lions QB shows he's got hops as he launches the jumper to keep extending the lead to the third quarter now. Zach Lutmer feeding it to Andrew Austin who powers his way in for the reverse layup. Central Lion takes the 38 to 31 lead. Pella Christian would just keep fighting as Dane Geating splashes in the three making this a one point game. Lots of scrambling here in the final seconds. Pella Christian gets the chance to make the game winner but it bounces and that will do. Central Lion holds on for the win 56 to 55. Uh, yeah, we're just all competitors. Uh, that's what competitors do. They just get through that adversity and they just they play they play, play through it. We got a lot of guys that play multiple sports and know know what it takes to win. And that's just what uh, what it takes to go to the state tournament and, and go to the state championship. The Lions heading back to the 2A championship game and they will face the winner of Western Christian and Roland Story. We'll pick up in the second. Caden Van Riggenmorter keeps the faith as he charges up to the rack for two and the Wolf Pack lead by three. Roland Story hangs in this one early as Boaz Clark knocks one down from beyond the arc for nothing but net. But Caden Van Riggenmorter keeps doing his thing, muscling up the floater from the paint. He finishes with 23 points on the day. Lots of unselfish ball movement from the Wolfpack. Check out this pass to Ashton Fanthole for the easy lay-in. And the Wolfpack are just cruising now. The brothers just on fire. Tate Van Riggenmorter getting in on the action, letting everyone know that was a beautiful three. And Western Christian is going to the championship game. Final score, 79-61. to I mean, it's been awesome. I mean, the, my brother and Carson, two people I've grown up playing with, Ashley Van Hall, Chandler Palmer, Hunter Hoffman, these all the kids that I've dreamed about doing this growing up with, and it's awesome to be in the spot right now. And what a treat we'll have with an all Siouxland showdown in the Class 2A championship game. Rounding things out is Bishop Heelan taking on Xavier in the Class 3A semifinal. Carter Keel starts things off, knocking down the first bucket of the day as he swishes in the three like a breeze. Xavier then goes on a 15-0 run, capped off by this layup by Aiden Yamakowski plus the and one foul. But Heelan evens things back out in the second when Matt Knoll dishes to Quinn Olsen, making the smooth layup. Xavier led 30 to 27 at half. Xavier turns on the gas in the second half as Tyler Netalicki shows off his stuff rising up to the rack. But Matt Knoll says he can get snazzy with the two as he takes it behind the back and up to the hoop. But Xavier would be too much in this one going on to take the win 72 to 59. Yeah, it was a dream come true. Um, every kid dreams about this when they're when they're little, so I loved it. Oh, it's it's a good thing because now we got a we got, we got a new era of what we need to do. We know we got to get here. We got to try and get here next year and keep going for years to come. The Crusaders back at state for the first time in 11 years, finishing with a 19 and 7 record. In Des Moines, Amber Salas, KTIV Sports Force.